Hello everyone, today we are going to find the sum of even numbers from 50 to 100 inclusive. We could do this easily by employing the sum of the first n terms formula of an arithmetic progression. Now if you are new to this formula, this represents the sum of the first n terms, while n represents the number of terms in the arithmetic progression that we are looking at. Also, a represents the first term of the progression, while d is the common difference between each term in the progression. Now coming back to this example, to visualize things better, we are going to list just a few terms in the progression starting with 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, and so on until 100. Now the key idea is to find what are the exact values of A, D, and N so that we could use this formula right here. So these are the even terms that we want. And the first term is actually 50. Now this means that A is equals to 50. Now between the terms 50 and 52, the common difference is simply 2. Because if we were to add 2 continuously to 52, it gives us an even number 54, 56, 58, and so on until 100. Now the next part is to determine the number of even terms between 50 and 100 inclusive. Now this can be a bit tricky. If we are not sure how to do that, let's imagine the numbers 1 to 10. Now if you see over here, there are 5 even numbers or by taking 10 divided by 2, which is 5. Now similarly for the number of even terms between 50 to 100, it is 100 minus 50 divided by 2. However, do remember to include the term 50 as required by the question. So the total number of even terms is 26 instead of 25. So all we need to do is to add a 1 over here. Now with these values of a, d, and n, simply plug them into the sum of the first n terms over here. So we could write s, 26, of the even terms is equal to 26 over 2 multiplied by 2 times 50 plus n minus 1, which is 26 minus 1 times 2. And this will be equal to 26 multiplied by 50 plus 25, which gives us a value of 1950. Thus, the sum of all the even numbers between 50 to 100 inclusive is 1950.